And now, a tourist targeted. My life flashing before my eyes. In a rental home robbery. Then, a trailer taken from a firefighter. Took power saws and cut through the metal backing. Now the expensive equipment finally found. The night team working two stories on just one station. At noon tonight, that trailer taken from a firefighter turning into a big bust of stolen property from others as well. The night team Sheldon Fox is where it was found in Northwest Miami-Dade. Sheldon? And the firefighter tonight, Craig, is going to get his trailer back. You can see it right there on the tow truck. This is no small feat. This has taken at least a half hour, maybe 40 minutes to get this big trailer, this 20, uh, I should say $10,000 trailer, 28 feet in length out of here. They're still working on that process right now. And behind the trailer, there's a big investigation going on. We can't show it to you because lots of the cops on duty right now are undercover, but we can show you what we saw just a few moments ago. Here it is, uh, empty, empty trailer, but you know, at least I have my trailer back. A fire captain reclaiming what's his. This stolen trailer packed with his expensive materials for his hobby of vintage car building and racing. Miami-Dade fire captain James Oliver showed us this video of his $10,000 trailer being stolen and hauled from his house last week as he was on duty. Fast forward to Tuesday night. So a day after the story of a stolen trailer belonging to a first responder, we end up out here in northwest Miami-Dade where that trailer's been recovered by the Miami-Dade Police Department and their undercover officers. Also, they say this might be part of a theft ring involving a stolen boat and dangerous dogs on the property to make things even more complicated as they seized the stolen goods. A jet ski and boat were also on scene here in northwest Miami-Dade of what detectives said looks like a home depot of stolen goods. They were led here as they followed the criminal case tied to this guy. Charge of grand theft. Aldo Sharafardine, whom they arrested Monday in connection with the stolen boat, and then, after seeing Captain Oliver's video, the stolen trailer, too. Because of the surveillance footage, um, they were able to match uh, to see that this was the same individual responsible for this theft right out of this person's uh, house. The Miami-Dade Marine Theft Task Force, which works with other agencies like Coral Gables, Hialeah PD and others, says it was on to Sharaf Ardeen for months. It's even more appreciative that the guy was caught. The task force members at this Northwest 31st Avenue property say before being busted, he was trying to sell a stolen boat to one of their detectives. Just the work that Miami-Dade police have done has been amazing. Because of this capture and because of your airing of this footage, we may have more victims that may come forward. And Miami-Dade Animal Services was here as well. They took three pit bulls from the property. We are live tonight in Northwest Miami-Dade. Sheldon Fox, 7 News 19.